The final stop of the 2014 Red Bull Air Race World Championship had drama, emotion and surprise at every turn of a thrilling season finale in the Styrian Mountains. A capacity 35,000 crowd cheering for the local hero gathered at the most spectacular venue of the year to watch a decision day in the closest title race in the series history. Paul Bonham was the first of the three contenders to go through in the top 12. Championship leader Nigel Lamb followed suit, but yet again, Austria's Hannes Arc went quickest. Into the Super 8, and Frenchman Nicolas Ivanov suddenly found his form, where previously he'd struggled to find the right lines. He was now the man to beat. Unlike Britain's Paul Bonham, whose hopes of winning a record third world title ran out of power at just the wrong moment. His time left him no better than fifth, and crucially, slower than Arc and Lamb. So the championship was now a two-man duel in the final four. It wasn't our weekend, you know, the second half of the year not really gone our way, but, uh, you know, there's always next year. The final four flights of the 2014 season would decide whether a Briton or an Austrian would become champion. But it was a Frenchman who set the pace again in the opening run. Even off, winner in Fort Worth had turned up the pressure yet more on Lamb and Arc. The title leader could settle the contest with victory, but was never a match for Ivanov. Advantage arc, and the crowd loved it. But before they could hail their home hero, Martin Schonke, on his first appearance in the Final Four, increased arc's chances of success by flying faster than Lamb. The Briton was now only third as arc entered the track, knowing that victory would crown him champion. But the script fell apart from the start. Arc was too slow. He failed to recover, then took a penalty for an incorrect level, and the title was lost. For Ivanov, it was a winning end to the season. Lamb was second, and Schonke third, his first ever podium. But the biggest cheer was reserved for the new world champion. An amazing feeling. Uh, you know, I, and I feel extraordinarily lucky. I really, really do because, uh, uh, you know, well, the, some things float my way and I'm just, uh, it's a great day. It's an unbelievable feeling. I feel so happy for my team and all the fans and supporters. Uh, it's just incredible. It's an indescribable feeling. Nigel Lamb only won his first race in May, but he's been on the podium ever since. Form that has taken him at last to the top of the Red Bull Air Race World Championship.